I mean, bro, this fucking thumbnail actually has me mixed up. Let's have a look, shall we? Maybe another banger, bro. It is Slum Bubba. I like CSGO skins, and I think a lot of you guys like CSGO skins too, but I don't really get how they work. Now, from the AI video I made Shut last time, I'm starting to kind of get a grasp I'm on the different styles, but I'm not quite to the point yet where I can look at a skin and be like, oh, that's obviously an anodized multicolored style. But I am trying to learn the different styles oh, of Valve. Oh April. my god, Chad, this is how the M41S case hadn't got leaked or how it accidentally, like, made a huge wave with skins collectors thinking oh my god they're gonna release m41s case hunt in their guide they feature an m41s case hunt look at all these things farmer's place farmer's fucking whatever this is called farmer's hot rod sheesh creators when they're making skins for the game um, and while i would like to make a video in the future kind of going further into these different styles one thing i know right now is that i really enjoy pattern based skins it adds a whole new aspect to unboxing yep. in which you, you know, you get a case hardened 5-7 out of a case. That's half the fun. The other half is seeing the pattern Aww. on the case hardened <laughs> pistol when it pops up. It's like double the excitement almost. Patterns make the skins market. So they make skins interesting, bro. And that's why, I don't know, no other digital item uh, uh, fucking, uh, uh, economy interests me as much as CSGO, the three things, having floats, right? Having patterns, 1,000 different patterns, having the different types of skins, the pattern uh, 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 indexes, bro. Absolutely crazy. It's the three pillars that make CSGO since it's so easy, but so in-depth at the same time. Wow. We're gonna look at some texture wow. files from CSGO, and we're gonna look at some skins with rare patterns and try to kind of find where in the texture files those weird patterns lie. So here we have the op paw pattern and it's pulled using the same method I just showed you guys. And I'm gonna go ahead and expand it out and brighten it up a little bit. There we go. And we're gonna pull in my op paw that I own. And as you can see, as I move it, it perfectly aligns with the background image. And you can think of the skin codes as almost like coordinates, oh, each one moving the op so to lovely. a different location on your screen here, and it's gonna produce a totally different looking op every it's time. Perfect. And obviously there's a lot of designs where you don't even notice they're different hardly, but this leads to some really rare designs, like for the op paw, where the golden cat is perfectly showcased in the center of the gun, thus making it more oh. desirable than some of the others. And, and this actually gets overpay. Pattern-based skins like this, you know we gotta talk about case hardened. Do you know what still I mean, is the are... coolest all paw pattern? This blew my mind when somebody, a viewer, showed this to me. I don't remember the viewer's name, so rip bows no credit. Peng. All paw pattern index 420. 420, we check the pattern, my brother, it has the stoned cat perfectly in the middle. This is one of the only patterns where the stoner cat is right in the middle, and it happens to be pattern index 420. It is perfect. And things like that happen if you have such a, you know, if you have 1,000 different pattern indexes. Absolutely lovely. Some truly crazy expensive skins and patterns in this, and I kind of want to show you how some of them line up when we expand this pattern out. The first one I want to talk about here is the Huntsman Dick Hardened pattern. And this one is really hard to find. I'm going to move it into place here. And if you actually want to know more about the Dick Hardened Huntsman knife, a guy actually made a really cool um, video on it, and I will link it down in the description below. Bobby Legend. And I'm designating this area kind of what I call the Dick area of the Case Hardened pattern. One of my now, favorite areas on the pattern pamphlet. Only Pixels, AK-47, Blue Gem, that has some beautiful Catavises on it. And I have great news if you're watching, Oni. The tip of your AK oh! falls in the dick hardened area <laughs> of the design. I knew it! I knew it! My AK, it feels special. It 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 emanates so much power, so much energy. I knew it. Or AK technically I knew it. a dick hardened AK-47 blue gem. Which by my calculations makes it worth about 400% overpay. 
and only if you end up selling this and you want to toss some of that my way for uncovering this, I humbly accept. I got you. I actually set this video to premiere and decided to keep working on it a little bit and someone actually left a comment, a uh, mystic here said that for the overgrowth there is a certain pattern where you get a heart shape on the tip of the suppressor and I thought that was really cool and you know obviously I was looking a lot into patterns for this video and you see a lot of the same skins oh, and I had never heard anything about <laughs> this them. guy. And 99% of people never noticed that. I showed it to Fanon. <laughs> <laughs> oh and he actually gave God. me a pattern ID to look up. And oh. sure enough, there definitely is a little bitty heart on that suppressor. Bro, what is and that? I pulled up the pattern in the files. And sure enough, it's right here. And again, big it reminds me of Michael Jordan. Got my knife. attention. I love when I find out something like this I didn't know about a skin that's been in the game for so long. It's very cool. Come on, man. Another one I want to talk about is the He's Mac reaching. 10 Last Dive. And I'm going to get some flack for this, but I think we're sleeping on this skin. I think this skin most of the time doesn't look great, but I think if you get a good pattern for it, it actually looks really nice. I actually, during this video, purchased one off the Steam Marketplace, and I'm really wow. happy with how it looks. I've opened one of these in the past, and, you know, it was just mostly orange, and and there was like nothing on it and i was like okay what is this and as you can see here with the one i purchased it really can have some cool patterns on it that's we pull cool up it's pattern sheet here and i adjusted the color best Chat, i hope i'm not the only one i never realized that this is a pattern based skin i never like I, I never had a true look at it whenever it came out i can't remember which case it is from i do not remember it being pattern based I've, i don't think i've ever noticed this is like I've, i only noticed like a week ago when somebody showed this um crazy i could but i couldn't get some of those grays to be orange like they are in the actual that's cool. design but it is some really beautiful artwork and i and think look, there is there's even a dick pattern on there imagine this right center Oy. to be other rare patterns in it like one where the seahorse covers the whole thing vibrating dildo pattern right there okay uh, there's some options so for that Next we up, I want to show the Minotaur's Labyrinth, and I know that if you've seen any videos about rare skins, you've seen this one. It's talked about a lot. Obviously, people want the skin where you can see the Lovely. Minotaur on it. And like I said, I know a lot of you have seen this one, but maybe you haven't seen its texture file, and I just thought it was super impressive so cool. how elaborate the pattern was. Ah, I have to skip it. I have to stop again. Chat, I'm so sorry. Is it okay if I skip? I'm a skipper wow, today. I'm I a skipper. Chat. <laughs> you know what we have? Chat, you know what we own? What you guys own and I, what I own, what we together own? The number one. Imagine now it pops up as number two. Uh, yeah, yeah. Would have been a classic. Number one lowest flow Jumper Minotaur. I'm not just pulling it up to flex. I'm not a flexer. I don't like flexing people. I think it's absolutely disgusting. I think it's a little bit cringe. Number one lowest float. Look at the pattern. Look at the pattern. Peng. Centered Minotaur. Centered Minotaur on the number one lowest float UMP. I would have shown this regardless whether we would own it, whether another person would own it. This is, in my opinion, one of the coolest skins in whole CSGO. And I'm so, it is one of my favorite skins ever. I'm so fucking happy, uh, happy that we had a chance to like buy this thing. It's I love it. Super impressive how elaborate the pattern was. Wow. <laughs> Now I want to get into what inspired this whole video, and that's the 5.7 Kami. And now, while some people may say it's a pretty unremarkable skin when you look at it, so it's sexy. produced some very interesting patterns on the butt of the gun. So you've got this one that kind of looks like a cowboy. You've got so this like a, one where it's like, you know, some eyes baker. kind of looking up at you. It's pretty cool. You've got this one even that looks uh, like a spider. That's pretty neat. And then... Is he trolling? <laughs> what? <laughs> it reminds me of XCC saying Cheeto. <laughs> Spider? <laughs> it's a walrus. Is he crazy? <laughs> we get to this one. Oh, what? Is he serious right now? That is not the correct pussy pattern, my friend. Where's the thing? I don't want to call it by name. We are on Twitch. But where's the thing? The... Where is it? That is the wrong pattern. The five seven Kami. Uh, pussy pattern. 
and I get the name. I obviously don't know what a pussy looks like, but this is everybody says this is it. So I'll is take this their stream word friendly? For it. And it, it's the whole reason I set out on this journey is I wanted to find where in the Kami pattern this was. And I'm happy to say, I think I have found where it is. So if we pull up the Kami pattern and we look here, I think this has to be it. And after dragging it into Photoshop and doing a little bit of warping to match the gun That's and it. really tightening up our crop. But I, I hate that you chose the wrong one. Chad, is it still the same spot? Because we have the little blob on the OG one, right? This is pattern index 909. This is the number one pussy pattern. The one that he has, is, it's a different pattern. It's, it's the wrong pattern. I think it is pretty clear we found the spot. A little nervous, never been to a restaurant that looked this much like a living room. Hey, here, let me help you. It's nice to finally meet you in person. This fucking guy. Yeah, no, they should bring you like your own bowl of bread here in a little bit. I think, well, he put this one, like, more toward my side. Yeah, then my so. camera's above it. Oh. <laughs> uh. Having just discovered that I can access these texture files, my mind's kind of going a million miles an hour thinking of like the various video ideas and stuff I can do with this. But just as an example, I've already made the Bubba Noir op skin that you'll see in a coming case, hopefully. And we can even look at some stickers and like really good quality on here, which I think is really cool. Oh, wow. And I was looking at one of my favorite Katavise stickers, but knowing Oni's watching, I would be absolutely remiss if I didn't pull up one of his favorites. Uh, bro, bro, this may be the last video we watched from Slumbaba. But by the way, Chad, what the fuck? Look at this. What is all the, the, the blue stuff around it? Is that what it looks? That's not how the sticker looks like, is it? Yeah, look at this. Not really. Why does it look like that in the thing? Oni's watching. I would be absolutely remiss if I didn't pull up one of his favorites. Next video, we have a spooktacular surprise. So I wanted to pose a proposal to Oni. He's been watching my videos and I had an idea. I currently have in the works a video based around community-made workshop skins having to do with Halloween horror kind of vibes, and I was going to post it around Halloween, but now I was thinking since the last video you watched, you said you were really interested in kind of the workshop seeing skins you've yep. never seen before. Yep. What if I presented them to you and you gave What's me the real one? on them? <laughs> like a case too. I've got my coverts, I've got my mil specs, all that. We show them to you I'm one done. by one, and I kind of just gave you a reaction. Done. Do you agree? Do you like this? Fuck me dry. Be mil spec, whatever. It's just kind of idea that popped I'm into done. my head when you were reacting. <laughs> Let me call Slum again to tell him in a few minutes we can start. Chat, this will be a lot of fun. A lot of fun. W. W, W, W video. This one, this one was a, a little bit maybe uh, even too sussy. Boys, leave Slum Baba some love. Always high quality videos right there. Leave a sub. Put on the bell. Cha-ching. Ping.